We're burning. Okay. We're getting it. We're getting it. Where'd Daddy go? Where'd go? Where'd Daddy go? Where'd you go? Oh, there you are. It's nice just being home. Just waking up in the morning and just playing with my boy and not having to go do anything or, or rush out, you know, just getting to have some quality time. Jump, 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 jump. Tucker just lights up when Ryan comes home from a trip or anything like that. He's, oh, Dad's home! Oh, you got more I'm very home. blessed to have him for a husband and hey. a dad. I'm gonna get you. <gasps> I'm gonna get you, I'm gonna get you! <laughs> <laughs> 12 days after his second career PGA Tour victory, Ryan Moore's priorities shifted thanks to another celebration, the birth of his first child, Tucker. The 2013 season, it did something very different than I had done in the past and where I only played two weeks in a row at any point because I just didn't want him to be out on the road too much. It's amazing what can change in a week or two. I'm just trying to soak it up and enjoy every little aspect of it. He's a nut about golf. And so dad's right there showing him. It's fun to see him love someone else so much. Put it. <gasps> Yay! Yay! Win the hole. Yay! <laughs> Keeping up with Tucker requires plenty of energy. Luckily, Ryan can always recharge with a visit to his favorite local lunch spot. I have the sushi bomb. It's one of my go to's. I have a handful of them, and it's. One of the ones I definitely have to go to every time I come home from a trip. And we're here. Sushi Bomb is one of those awesome little hole in the wall places that not a ton of people know about, which is good because it's tiny. And if it was incredibly packed all the time, you'd be sitting outside for a long time waiting for a table. I try something new just about every time I'm in there, and I've never been disappointed. And do TPC Summerlin, my home course here in Las Vegas. Out here, probably 90% of the time I'm home. You know, it's great practice facilities, the course is always in great shape, and it's a fun place to play. After all that sushi, now it's time to go get some practice in, so me and Troy are gonna go hit the back of the range. Those are all pretty good, actually. We don't work on my swing so much as we work on just little things around it that kind of help my swing get better. And lately, we've been focused on wedges. Hit one, Ryan. We start at five balls from 40, five from 50, 60, 120. And then we'll do different clubs with different ones of those yards, obviously just to change the feel and kind of challenge them more. It's about how far the ball is carrying, not necessarily how far it's rolling. 57. 56, six. Yep. That's a fun game for me. I get to guess how far I hit it. 69. 70.7. Ooh. I've seen some direct impact already, and it just makes every aspect of my game better when I focus on that and then work on those things. Ah. Finding a balance between family life and practice isn't easy for any PGA Tour player. Ah, there he is. But last October, Moore's hard work paid dividends in Malaysia on the 72nd hole. Really good. What a tremendous shot. Almost a year to the day after the birth of his son, Moore won for the third time in his career, his life and game in perfect harmony. I was wondering, did he think back to all those hundreds of 60 yards and shots we've been hitting on the back of Summerlin, and that's what he said, so that was quite encouraging. I want to win golf tournaments. I need to give myself the best opportunity to do that, and I base all of my decisions on that. If you're not getting better in this game, Somebody else is passing you up. That's just how it works.